Hey, so I'm Levi from We Roll With It and Sweat Equity Creative, and I'm here to introduce you to Bruce Banner. He is a Touring build um, from Golden, Colorado. Bruce has Backwoods uh, Adventure Mods bumpers, a prototype for the Backwoods Adventure Mods roof rack. He's got a uh, Terra Wagon snorkel. Um, underneath the van, what we're looking at is a full solid axle swap out. So we've got Dana 60s for the front and rear axles, old school hub lockers in the center of the wheels. We're riding on, we're riding on um, 20 by 12 black rhinos with a 37 by 13 and a half Falcon tire with the MT Wild Peak. Uh, we've got Dirt Logic six inch coilovers inside. This has a full Atlas transfer case, a three to one, and a bunch of custom bracketing underneath and custom drive shafts that'll get us all the way back to the rear end. He's got a Linex coating from uh, Linex the Coast in Seaside, Oregon. We've done a bunch of custom windows inside. He has a lighting system from S-Pod that brings us out to Pathfinder lights. Um, up on top for accessories, we've got rugged radios, the VHF and the UHF. We have a WeBoost antenna that drops. Um, we've got Max Tracks. We've got Rome Adventure Co. boxes. Um, we're working out a prototype for Backwoods Adventure Mods on their new ladder system. We'll bring you around to the back. We got Backwoods Adventure Mods rear box system and, and storage. We've also got their rear tire carrier. So inside, Bruce has 600 amp hours of lithium batteries in the Victron MultiPlus system, all built in by Turig. We've also got 39 gallons of water and the Ricks and heating system, all built in by Turek. We've got the Thule awning. And we've got Shieldman seats inside. And as you pan inside, you'll be able to see all of our different fabrics and finishes. In here, we've got the airliner cabinets that are exclusive to Turek builds. We've got their beautiful walnut countertops and matching floors. And then we wound up putting in uh, a nice Sahara tartan fabric inside. So we'll take a look at the gauges. Inside Bruce has got a eight inch iPad for media work. He's got the S pod system. He's got the halo system um, for our, our internal stereo that runs off the house batteries and not the start battery. And he also has the Garmin Overlander. The Garmin Overlander is for when we have no services and we're out doing overland tours. You can see the transfer case here in the center. So that's the Atlas switch. He can run in front wheel drive, rear wheel drive, uh, four wheel high and low. And let's let you take a look at the Victron system. So this shows our charging. We've got 53 watts coming out of our 375 watt panel on the roof and we're pushing in 97% on our 600 amp hours. And this is our multi-control for our inverter system. And then this is our, uh, our heat exchanger and our thermostat for our Rickson system. We've got a full shower on this side and then our vent fan up on the ceiling. It's nice because our van has over cabinet and under cabinet lightings with dimmers. And then we also have ceiling puck lights as well headliner shelf with curtain and then we've got full Touareg uh, drop curtains. These curtains are fabulous. You're able to pull them and accordion them down to any height that you want for your van. They look well insulated too. They're awesome. They're fantastic. We've got a full MB Court sound system inside the van. So we've got interior speakers, exterior speakers, and speakers underneath of the van. So we can portray uh, two different sound systems. You can play one type of music inside, or you can do a whole nother set of music outside. So we've got two separate music systems for the van too. Awesome, man. Well, thanks yeah. for the walk around. Absolutely, you're very welcome. We'll see you guys on the road.